Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Today we're making this orange pork. It's absolutely delicious. The acidity of the orange juice, the tenderness of the pork, the veggies, and it's easy to make and do it in 30 minutes. So let me walk you through this and let's get started. So what I've got here is a, about a half a kilo of pork that I've kind of cut up. And I'm going to crack in an egg. As I always say, let's get cracking. Some pepper. I'm a pepper lover, so I'm going to add quite a bit. And of course, some salt. Two tablespoons of cornstarch. And this is just going to bring everything together and make it shine a little bit. I'm going to take my hands and massage this up. And of course, the pork loves a massage. And by the way, how do you take a sick pig to the hospital? A ambulance. <laughs> then I'm going to add some oil to a preheated pan. I'm using olive oil, but you know, you can use vegetable oil, whatever you like. Put the pork in, and I'm just going to fry this until it browns fairly well. After about six minutes, three minutes on each side, the pork is done beautifully, so I'm just going to set it aside on a plate. Next up, in the same pan, you don't want to change anything because you've got delicious stuff happening there. I'm going to add in half a chopped onion, small chopped onion, three cloves of chopped garlic, and a chopped up thumb-sized ginger. So what I'm going to do is saute these just until they're fragrant. After a couple of minutes of fragrance, we're going to add in some button mushrooms. You can use the mushrooms of your choice. But this is about five that I've chopped up. Some celery, two stalks. Now you can use the veggies of your choice. And we'll just fry these for a few minutes. And you got to remember to toss these around just a little bit. After that, this has been like two or three minutes, I'm going to add in a cup of orange juice, two tablespoons of soy sauce, and a quarter cup of water. Now what I'm going to do here is just let this boil. After a boil, I'm going to add in two tablespoons of cornstarch, diluted in two tablespoons of water, just to thicken things up, and stir things around. Once things have thickened up, I'm going to put the pork back in, and of course stir it around again, just until it's nicely coated with those delicious juices. And there you have it, guys, our orange pork in 30 minutes. Plate this up over a bed of steaming hot rice. Of course, spoon some of those delicious, or that delicious juice over the top. Mmm, this looks and smells so good. Garnish it up with some chives on the top, and you're good to go. So let's give this a taste test. Mmm, so good. Pork is tender, the acidity of the orange juice. Spice is absolutely beautiful. You gotta try this. You can always find this recipe at cookandshare.com. Head on over there, have a look. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.